I'm in love with the way that you be moving I am back with a video after almost like a year of not having any video if you're new here my name is Ranga I do like lifestyle uh, vlogs beauty etc I do everything on this channel I've been MIA for like almost a year I can't believe it like a lot has happened you guys I'm going to do a separate video where I'm going to address why I've been MIA what you guys could look out for uh, for the channel in the next coming weeks um i've missed you guys i've really really missed the space where i just used to come and um talk to you guys about everything and you know nothing today i thought do you know what there's a video that uh my good old very few followers have always been asking for particularly kelly hey babe if you're watching this video it's for you girl you've been ask asking for this video for like a long time i'm going to talk about my favorite favorite red lipsticks or rather my red lipstick collection if you've been following me for a while you know like red is my nude like i'm always wearing red so i've got about 17 lipsticks to go through um i might swatch i think i'll swatch my favorites and then the rest i'm not going to swatch because this video would be long and i'm intending for this video to be 10 minutes um nine minutes max um so i'm gonna just swatch like my favorite so let's let's get in there i'm going to actually really start by uh my favorite favorite at the moment and it's going to be this dose of colors um uh, kiss of fire this is a lippy not to mess with you guys i discovered this um about a year ago and then i, I didn't purchase it until like early no, I, I discovered this in 2017 and then I didn't purchase it until like early last year and I wasn't a fan because it's like a strawberry red. It's like, I don't, I wouldn't say it's like a blood red. It's like a strawberry red. I'm wearing it today actually, but because your girl still is recording from her phone, the um, picture quality is not as good. I'm going to swatch this for you guys um, and um, hopefully you can see like how beautiful this is how beautiful is that red i am sort of leaning on my kitchen counter guys because this is the best place where the best light is so by the time this video is done girl my um back is gonna be aching okay so yeah i love this lipstick it's really really good i would say this is like going to be my summer favorite red you guys the next thing i'm going to swatch is like um a lippy called uh, paparazzi i was hooked up by uh, my girl booksome she is always the plug hey girl if you're watching uh thank you so much for telling me about paparazzi because it's one of my favorite reds this retails for i think 3.99 i think it's four pounds it's a barium lippy but this is up there with your um expensive uh lippies it is a blue red it is like i love this red it is just so good you can you see the difference it's a deeper red to um as compared to that this was wedge swatching because it's like one of my favorites in fact this was like my most worn um lippy of last year the next one i'm going to talk about is lime crime when this lipstick came out you guys they were not available to purchase in the uk and we went all over ebay we couldn't find it until i think some shop called cult came up and these were on sale this is really really good i'm not going to swatch it it's not a favor as such but it's in my collection and i tend to use it particularly for work because it's um got a very very long uh wearing um duration so yeah i i, I absolutely love it my other favorite that I'm actually going to swatch is this Sephora lipstick. Now, you guys, I actually don't know the name of this lippy, but it's it's got um, O1 uh, on it. I if, What I'll do is I'll swatch the name uh, down below when I actually do a research. But when I was traveling, uh, um, when I was in Rome last year, around about this time, actually, I went into Sephora for the first time. Yo, I was so happy. And the only thing that I could afford to buy at that time was a red lipstick. So I was like, what could I buy from Sephora today? And it had to be this red lippy. It's a bit of a deep red. I really, really like this lipstick. I tend to wear it like with white. It comes out really, really well with white. Um, there it is. Can you see like how different reds are? You can own like 50 reds and they can never be the same. That's uh, slightly sort of nearer to that but at the same time it becomes warmer um as it dries um i'll show you guys after these have dried and best believe i remember which is which the other lipstick i'm going to talk about but i'm not going to swatch is this wet and wild lipstick when i first came across this um i was on instagram and it popped up uh on my um timeline i was like oh my god i absolutely need to have this it's called missy and fierce 
Missy and Fierce E930B. It is a very bright red. It's really, really nice. I don't like the finish of this, but it's a good red. Like if you're on a budget, I think it cost me like $5.99 if I'm not mistaken. So it's good on your pocket, but it's really, really good. I've been um, wearing Wet n Wild lipis for a while now. Um, the next one I'm going to talk about is this um, Vanity Red no vanity rain goodness guys i am telling lies this is a color drain lipstick which was recommended by my girl uh, hazel she had been wearing this like almost every summer holiday that we traveled to and each time she wore it like i'll be like oh my god can i borrow it because it's such a neon red i absolutely love this it um it lasts like all day like you know you can have something to eat with this and it will like stay on I love it that's it there it's like a what i call like a pinky orange red i absolutely love like how this um dries I'll, I'll show you guys like after it's dry can you see like how that paparazzi is drying you guys like it is a bright bright red i absolutely love it you guys um it's like one of my favorite really the next one i'm going to talk about is not what's a swatch but it's by jordana and these cost five pounds on uh, beauty bay i absolutely love the jordana lippies i tend to wear this for work because it's um you know it's quite affordable and i like the finish of it and it's not too bright it's just so warm i like warm red sometimes for work because i don't want to turn up looking like I'm, a, I'm ready to turn up like it's work i need to be a bit calm i used to shy away from wearing reds for work but now like red is my nude like i don't care Last Christmas, I was just feeling like spending money that I didn't have. So I went ahead and bought a Kristen Dior um, lipstick. I think I spent 26 pounds on it. I'm not sure. I can't remember. It was a gift to me, so I wasn't really keeping tabs. It's called Rouge Dior. I don't know that, if that's how you pronounce it, but girl, <laughs> you know what it's like. So this is it. I absolutely love it. It's, the finish is matte. Um, I would say moisturize, 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 girl, for this lipstick. It's really, really nice. It's not as matte but it's really nice it's something that i would wear like if i'm going um for a wedding and i just want like a soft red you know like something that doesn't dry because i feel like sometimes matte lipsticks can make your lips your makeup look a bit harsh so at the times like when you want like a red lipstick and still want to look popping i would suggest you wear like a warm lipstick because it's you know moisturizing and you can still look soft etc so that's how it swatches that's it at the top there right there um yeah just amazing and that's the sephora one is drying that's the dose of colors one um this one uh goodness i've forgotten now um oh well when i go back to the swatches i will link i, I will um let you guys know what is what the next one i'm going to talk about i'm not actually going to swatch it it's a maybelline one and that's the one called pioneer this is really really good i discovered it in 2017 sort of october time absolutely love this lipstick the only problem i have with this lipstick is it lasts too too long like it will not come off you guys it will stay on your lipstick like on your lips like paint so if you're one of those people who are very 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 sensitive and you don't want to have like lipstick residue in the morning then this is not for you girl because it's so pigmented the pigment on this one is really good i think it retails for 9.99 it's a good price for a maybelline lippy which really lasts like you know this one it, it's 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 a good swatch i might in fact let me oh, do you know i won't swatch it because i'm i'm going out later and it's one whereby it's yeah it won't come off and i'm not about to walk with like red uh tattoo um hands the next one is actually a lipstick by a Zimbabwean um, uh, business owner. Uh, it's called Kisses by Nya. I bought this uh, via Snapchat. Uh, I think Nya has got a website. I'm not sure, but I purchased mine via um, Snapchat because I follow her on Snapchat. And I think it was £10, if I'm not mistaken. Nya, don't kill me if I'm getting the price wrong. I absolutely love Lady Nya's uh, Kisses by Nya Lippi. It's very soft. The finish of it reminds me of the Gerard's Cosmetic Lippies. It's, it's a very soft finish. Hardly dries your lips. I absolutely love this. I think she did really well on this lippy. I'm going to swatch this because actually um, it is a nice lipstick and I actually love it. It's, um, I'll put it, I'll place it with my uh, top favorite reds to be honest because I absolutely love it. I think it's not talked about enough. Well done girl. Um, this is it there and of course I'll show you when it dries out. Um, next one I'm going to talk about is actually a Jared's cosmetic um, lipstick and this one is called Immortal. I saw this on Kefilwe Mabote. I don't know if you follow her. She's on Instagram. She's a lifestyle uh, uh, blogger, vlogger, designer, uh, you know, influencer. Um, and she uses this quite a lot and it looks amazing on her. I have been wearing this like for the past maybe four years now. 
absolutely love it i'm on my uh, second bottle the other one my sister stole when i went to zimbabwe last time this is it there it's, it deserves a swatch can you see it's like almost lady nyas one they are like the same like the finish the way they apply it's almost sort of similar i feel like it's actually a dupe i love it it's, it's really really good love immortal and you know for your budget it's also good i think gerard's tend to retail for like nine pounds or so uh this one i'm going to talk about was a favorite from long time i'm not going to swatch this actually because it hasn't been a fave lately but it's george by vault cosmetics jackie mcgido has been in the makeup game for a while my uh, the packaging has since changed i've had this for a long time but i still wanted to talk about it i don't know if jackie still sells it but it's in my red collection and now and again i wear it um the other reds that i'm going to talk about this one is my absolute favorite you guys like if i had to choose a red lipstick to keep in my life it would have to be ruby Woo. that's the first red lipstick that i ever ever wore and i mean every girl knows about ruby Woo. like this lipstick deserves a red kiss i love it absolutely i love it so i just want to give you like some top tips for applying ruby Woo. you find that it's nicer and brighter on some people when you wear ruby Woo, you could actually apply ruby Woo from this side uh, like from the back it gives you a brighter red when you apply it flat like that it just gives you like a warm red on the sides it also gives you like a bright red so balance it one day you are um, applying it properly and the other day um swatch it from your back uh, from the back goodness from your back <laughs> you guys i can't like you know english it was never my first language literally uh no this one shouldn't have made it here um I want to talk about all fired up i do not like this lipstick like at all each time i've worn it it's like gathers on my lips like i don't know what they were trying to do when they created the sleepy but it's a very very bright pinky red by um mark and it's called all fired up many people love the sleepy and it looks good on them so i just really wanted to talk about it because it's in my red lipstick collection now and again i'll wear it particularly when i'm on holiday and want to just look bright and i'm not caring about like how my lips are looking because i'm having so much ice cream and there's the sun and my lips are not dry um it is see sorry i'm speaking so fast i just really want to ensure this video stays relevant and short the other lipstick i want to talk about is relentlessly red this one like all fired up also does gather on my lips and i don't know whether it's my lips or it's the formula of the lipstick i'd really love to hear your comments if you own this i find that people with very moisturized lips do not need do not complain about this lipstick but my lips are naturally dry like i've tried everything i drink water at least two liters a day i moisturize like i've got so many lip moisturizers i can't tell you enough but this always really dries my lips out but um it is quite a nice red to wear the last one i'm going to talk about was actually gifted by a friend last summer um no last christmas and it's a ysl lipstick and it's called zero one it's yeah it's just got a number uh, 62 rue something like that um i will obviously link it down below it is a very very bright red again it's a it's a lipstick these are very very moisturizing and i love the smell of this so i always kind of smell it i love the packaging um of the ysl lipsticks as well it's just very luxurious and i think it's a nice um lipstick to have as part of um your red lipstick collection so these are the lipsticks as they have uh, dried uh, can you see you can have lots and lots of reds but they can never ever look the same so I'm giving you permission to go and spend girl i'm going to link each lipstick that i talked about down below so you can click and shop and enjoy girls so we can have these red lips together sorry about the angle that i'm standing i just really wanted to be close to you guys so you can see the lipsticks and so you can hear me properly the way my life is set up right now i cannot actually sit down and record a video because otherwise i'll be either very too i'll be too low or i'll be too high it's just not really balancing but it's been really really good to come back i think i feel like this video was so overdue and needed to be um recorded as soon as possible my earrings are from our chira collection if you are not following us we are on instagram chira corner uh, on instagram uh, these retail for about nine pounds uh, from our collection they are very very huge particularly like if you're going to do a bun you know you can have these large hoops um yeah so i'll see you guys in my next video i'm not sure what it's going to be about but oh it will be the story time of where i've been and what's going to happen with the channel so i look forward to seeing you guys and goodbye